Hi, Adam Ring with Innovative IDM. You know, I was just uh, teaching a class last week and the topic came up about some different types of sensors that are used for industrial automation. And so I thought, well, hey, I'll take a few minutes and just go over some of the basics of how these different types of sensors work. So the first thing I'd like to talk about is the inductive proximity sensor. These are very widely used in automation. They're used to sense ferrous metal objects. So basically, any, any kind of a metal object that we need to know if it's present or absent, or is there a part that's in place? Is the part missing? Is a actuator extended or retracted? Any way that we need to sense something and it's a ferrous metal, we can use this. And basically what it does is it has this tractor beam that it emits from the tip of the sensor, and it's really what we call an eddy current killing oscillator. And so what that means is there's this electrical field generated outside the tip of this sensor, and when a ferrous object comes nearby, it actually absorbs that field, and the sensor is able to then detect, hey, there's something there, and it gives us a signal. Another type of sensor that's similar to the inductive proximity sensor is the capacitive proximity sensor. This uses a little bit different sensing technology in that instead of looking for a ferrous metal object, it actually looks for a difference in the capacitance of an object. So in other words, how much does it absorb electricity? And so a real common application for this is we can mount this thing on the outside of say like a plastic tank that contains water and we're able to detect the level of the water inside the tank. So we can actually look through the outer surface and see the material that's in, as long as the capacitance properties of that material are different enough from the outer material to where we could literally just tune out what that outer material is and figure out, hey, is there something inside or not? Then we have another really common type of sensor that we use in automation, and that's called the photoelectric sensor. As its name implies, it basically uses light in order to detect objects. So something like this has an emitter and a receiver, and so it emits a light beam, and then it bounces off of an object, comes back to the receiver, and if it sees the light, then it knows, hey, there's an object there. If it doesn't get a reflection back, then it says, hey, there's nothing there. And so it's able to easily detect when there's an object present or absent. Real common use for these is on conveyors. If you want to detect, hey, there's a box moving down a conveyor, and as soon as it passes by that photo eye, it reflects the light and says, oh, that object's there. So very, very common use in industry. If you'd like to learn more about these types of sensors and others, please take a look at the Innovative IDM Knowledge Base. Our website is InnovativeIDM.com, and we'd love to share some information with you. Remember, we're the home of the legendary customer experience.